Right, I don't, don't know if this, like, up-and-coming generation or, like, some of the old-school generation have got this new superpower I don't know about that can just completely know your whole life by looking at a 15-second comedy video or dance video. They can tell you haven't got a job. They can tell you've been smoking crack through your granddad's school shoes for six days on the run and you need some sleep. Like, I've, I get called a wizard, a crackhead on a daily. Go and get a job. Uh, no, go and have a bath. Like, I could understand if I was lay on the streets in my video with a needle hanging out my arm. But I'm doing a dance in my back garden, so they're solely judging me on my looks. Which is quite worrying, really, isn't it? It's not very intelligent. So I was just put like, oh my God, I can't believe you think these videos are contributing to society. Let's go back to the days when social media didn't exist and people had to work a nine to five job. Like, what did you think I did before social media? I didn't just work a nine to five job. I worked a fucking 90 hours a week. I worked multiple jobs, mate. I've paid multiple tax. And like, just because I'm on the internet, does that mean I don't pay tax as well or work? Like, what's wrong with you? Like, I don't know if it is a generation thing, because back in my day, when there was no social media, if you said something to someone, you fronted it. <laughs> yeah. So what I mean by that is, if I wanted to go out and call someone a tramp, I'll tell them, that they're a docile because they haven't got a job, even though they're walking down the street with a briefcase, because that's the logic we're dealing with. Well, they're going to smack me in the face, aren't they? And then I'm never going to call them a tramp again, am I? No. But it's this internet. So, like, people get fresh and say stuff with chest. Like, it's fine. <laughs> but then they call me embarrassing with a mentality like this, watching a video and saying, oh, this is what my tax goes on. Like, <laughs> what? what? I'm dancing in my back garden. What, what, why, what's your tax got to do with anything? It's just ridiculous. People need to, like, get off the internet. You're like, I come from the generation where there was no internet, where there was four channels on the toilet, where you played out all day, whereas if you wanted to call someone a crackhead, then, again, you fronted it. There was repercussions to your trolling, but no, not nowadays. And I agree with, uh, let's go back to the days before social media, but what's that got to do with me sharing a meme on Facebook? I don't... Like, you know, I'm multi-skilled, multi-qualified, multi-talented, been a professional entertainer for years, worked all my life. But you think I wouldn't get a job if social media didn't exist? Like, <laughs> like it's actually worrying because these people, this up-and-coming generation who's trolling and all that, they haven't read a book. They just sit on TikTok all day with YouTube watching people play games. And then the other half that troll me are middle-aged women. Or, like, say, middle-aged men projecting the bullshit on me and um, look like they've been booted through Primark backwards themselves. It's crazy. But on a serious note, I feel sorry for the people who are lacking confidence and who, you know, like, post stuff on social media and because someone troll comments on it, they delete it and that. Don't do that. Don't adapt your personality because what some stranger might think. You Like, you need to fill up your cup and express you and find out who you are. And you're not going to be able to do that if you're suppressing your personality or catering your life decisions on strangers' opinions. But don't get me wrong, I used to be like that. When I was younger, my whole persona, my whole day-to-day -day was all about based on other people's opinions. And I didn't realise until I got up out the rat weight race and went and travelled the world and went and experienced life and, you know... Uh, rejudged my priorities, realised that, like, I've wasted all this time making decisions based off other people's opinions. You know what I mean? Like, I have people commenting on my posts all the time, like, say, trolling me, saying all sorts, and five years ago, I would have deleted the whole post and adapted me. Nah, don't do that, guys. Be as you as you can. As long as you've got a good person, you've got integrity and morals, then who gives two shits what some stranger thinks? Honestly, 99% of my comments are positive. And 1% are just idiots, so you can't argue with stupid, don't even try. <laughs>